previously on episode 14. 14 mile an hour oh shoot is it able to here I'll, I'll move I'll move quick you have to hit unload or anything no oh it's got some beans in here it's got some beans in here that's right shoot hold on let me go dump some beans no not yet okay what about the John Deere have you checked on that I'm gonna check on it right now okay they'll so start unloading that thing oh it keeps turning around in weird spots <laughs> yeah. oh okay well I'll run right alongside it quick what percent is she at about 68 okay I'll unload if you want to just unload right here quick oh boy there we go we'll leave that guys and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the straight truck and I'm going to just go start trucking down there quick is what we're going to do I, hopefully I can get this all sold by the end of the video that's the goal corn harvest is rolling baby we're flying through this Okay, one thing about that combine is it takes a while to unload. And the gleaner, dude, I gotta stay away from it. Because right now, it's like just insanely loud. It's like blown. I have headphones in. It's all just blowing my eardrums out. I gotta lower the game volume. But then the 4760, it's just like normal. It's just a normal uh, amount of sound. Welcome back to episode number 15. You guys have been awesome, man. Well, I guess we've never been to episode number 15 yet, but we were on episode number 14. But hey, we're back on episode number 15. You guys have been awesome, dude. This has been sweet. This is going perfect. Squad Farms, everything's working out good with it. I'm liking it. We're getting a ton of views. A ton of people are loving it. A ton of people are hitting that like button, dude. I thank you guys for your support. I don't, I don't think I thank you guys enough. Truly, I don't think I thank you guys enough. But we're gonna what we're gonna do is I'm gonna sell this grain quick okay and so I have seven thousand dollars now I got a lot of comments on last video you guys kind of caught me there so a lot of you guys were like squad at one point you had seven thousand dollars and at another point you had eighty thousand dollars how'd you do it did you add money did you add money and you didn't tell us squad no what I did is well I guess I kind of add money I took out a loan and I just borrowed a crap ton of money like two hundred thousand dollars and I bought uh telehandler to flip over because the grain cart was flipped over back here so i bought it real quick drove it down the street flipped it over and then i returned all the money so that's basically what we did and i sold the telehandler now but dude i, I was like using it i was like dude and actually what i was doing is because the corn spilled i was shoveling the corn back in with the bucket i was like you know what this could be good this could be good this could be real good we could use the telehandler so i'm, I'm considering getting telehandler i don't want to get uh, in game one i want to get like a, a bobcat one or something i think that'd be sweet so wait what are we even unloading here i need to unload the semi is what i need to do okay so i think the semi's unloading oh wait no okay i don't even know what that is okay oh it's the first grain car okay sweet we're selling it all i'm gonna show you guys because like the fun part is selling it all by the way if you're not subscribed subscribe and you're in the chance to win an xbox one that's all you gotta do subscribe and you're entered in the giveaway to win an xbox one okay we gotta pull this other one forward um nope nope we gotta back up there we go okay we should be unloading i think we're unloading this right here there we go yeah we're unloading that right there um and so i'm gonna announce that in a couple of weeks yet let's go beginning of april sometime beginning of april i'll let you guys know exactly when and I'll, I'll let you guys know everything oh dude it's actually tilting okay usually a lot of times it doesn't it, I, I never even saw it tilt okay sweet that's all sold dude we're not even getting that much money from this at all okay and now it's just the back one i thought we'd be getting a lot more money we're really not getting that much money at all dude i feel like the price should be up just a little bit better you know because man we are not getting that much money <laughs> dude okay we're kind of tight on money those pigs cost a lot dude i feel like man i feel like maybe i should just give it all to the pigs i should just send all the pigs but one thing we gotta do so we're selling the skid loader today i don't like that thing we're getting rid of it i hate it you guys always see me buying equipment how about we sell some equipment so we're selling the skid loader because the tractor the, the 4755 dude it can easily do it but hey we did get little blue you guys named it little blue little blue and i like i like the name i like the name little blue so that's the new holland t4 that i got you guys chose the name little blue it is and I, I think a lot of people agreed on that name there's others which are pretty fun but i like little blue that's a nice name for it so what we're gonna do is i'm gonna head up here oh also okay i just said we were always buying stuff everybody always criticizes me for buying stuff which I, I like to buy a lot of stuff in game and stuff it's kind of fun but i was considering deciding between two tractors and then i think next video 
I'll do a showcase of the two tractors I'm thinking about buying. We'll head to the guy's house on this map. It's for sale. We'll take a look at the tractors, and I'm going to let you guys decide on which one we're going to choose. That's going to be next video, not this video. So episode number 16. Okay, we're heading up here, and then I'm going to load up. We'll take the comments. We'll load up the trailer. We'll get the trailer connected, and then we're going to head over to uh, another farmer's house, and we're getting, giving him, we're, we're selling him the skid ladder is what we're going to do. We're going to drop it off there and sell it to him. And then also, oh, dude, by the end of this video, I want to be harvesting. We want to get field five harvested. We still got to keep going on beans. We still, oh, wait, oh, radio, my bad. I was trying to pull up the map. So field five over there, it's just straight back and forth. So I should be able to hire out some workers too, which will be nice. And the, be the beans, we screwed up with fertilizer. And so they're not yielding much at all. It kind of sucks. I Oh, dude, oh, I, dude, I have a whole, oh my gosh, those gravity wagons are going crazy. My whole goal is for one video is to not take out a sign. And I just took out a sign, so I guess not this video. We're not going for the goal of this video. Maybe next video we won't take out a sign. Um, and then, oh, dude, I got to get disking a ton of stuff. That's kind of one of the reasons why I'm buying this new tractor is, I guess I kind of give a hint, uh, a hint to, like, disc up all this stuff. But we do have the 4755 we can still use. But I feel like I'm using it on the grain car right now, you know? Okay, don't hit a sign here, squad. Don't hit a sign, man. There we go. We're good. We're good. Okay. Um, okay, sweet. Now we just have... Okay, so we just have that bean field over there to do. Um, should be good. And then what we're going to do from there is... Holy crap, dude. We just... Oh, dude. Oh, my gosh. I just took out that side right when I was trying to the inside, brothers. Okay, what we're going to do is... I'm just going to... Hold on. Where... Shoot. I drove... Oh, I guess... Okay, hold on. What? I got to figure out what we all even got going on the farm. For now, I'm just going to park her over here for now. It's 10 in the morning. It feels really, it, honestly, okay, let's get this baby up to noon quick. Let's run the clock at like times five. Don't let me forget I have the clock run. Okay, we're gonna head over here. And then, okay, we got the combines over here. Oh shoot, we didn't finish harvesting corn. We didn't finish yet. Okay, I gotta finish harvesting this field is what we gotta do. Or actually, no, we gotta, okay. We're gonna finish harvesting the field and at the end of the video, we're gonna go deliver that uh, skid loader. Okay, we're gonna hop in the Magnum now. I'm not sure what we all got go. Oh, you know what? I should have put the straight truck over here. That's what I should have done. That's what we gotta do. So right now the Magnum's just sitting in the field. Man, I need a couple helpers. I need. Okay, guys, what mod works best? I need like a helper mod, the AI mod, but it actually like follows the field's path and does it for me. Like the way that way I can hire out a worker and they can disc everything up for me. You know, like the AI mod I got doesn't work that good i need a mod that actually works and a helper will actually do a field that like goes back and forth in a circle and round and is all weird shaped and stuff that way it actually gets it done is what i need i need some type of helper like that okay we're gonna jump in the straight truck and then we're gonna pull her in the field now a lot of you guys were okay with me driving the putting loading all the grain in the straight truck and two gravity wagons a lot of you guys thought that was pretty realistic having two gravity wagons behind here i, th I think it is I think the straight truck does have enough power. Straight truck, grain truck, whatever you want to call her. I know a lot of people like call her different names. Okay, we're going to pull in the field. And then I'm going to unload this bad boy and we're selling that skid loader. Dude, I want to use it. Uh, there's nothing to really use the uh, the T4. Or little blue, little blue, little blue. I, I, uh, no, little blue. We're not saying T4. Little blue. There's nothing to use a little blue on right now, really. Besides the auger. Okay, sweet. That's unloading. We'll let that unload. I got to fire up these combines. What do you guys think of the combines? What do you guys think of the combines? I was... Okay. Oh, dude. These are all full. Oh, man. These are all full. Okay, shoot. What I'm going to do... Okay, how much do we have left? Okay, we don't have much at all. Sweet. I can get this knocked out. I'm going to hire out one worker, and then the rest is just going to go. Oh, this combine goes 12 mile an hour. That's right. I forgot about this. Oh, let's lift her up. And then where's that gleaner at? Okay, gleaner's back here. I wonder if the gleaner's full. Okay, we're going to leave that running. Tab into the gleaner. Is that still unloading? Oh, shoot. The straight truck's already full. Okay. Oh, dude. The straight truck's already full. Okay, let's fire up the 49... Uh, for 4960. 4760. We're going to back up to the other gravity wagon. Holy crap. We are filling these things so quick. Okay, some of this we got to just start... Oh, boy. We got to start storing in... There we go. Should be good. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to run across the field and run out there. You guys are probably wondering, some of you guys who haven't seen my videos, why aren't there duels on this thing? And it's because the duels get in the way when we're pulling up next to the combine. For some reason, it just it didn't work out too good. And we got, we had to take off the duels, even though there should be duels. I wonder how full this gleaner is. I, is it full? Can you see grain, guys? Hold on. Okay, okay, it's got some room. Yeah, it's got some room. So what we're going to do is we're going to pull over here. Oh, let's not hit the combine. And let's pull a swing around here. 
There we go. Okay, we are kind of flying through here. Um, see, if we had duels on, it would probably hit the header. That's why we don't have duels. There we go. She's unloading. Sweet. Holy crap, dude. Look at the top of this. Let me climb up on here. Oh, dude, look at it. Holy crap, this is sweet just watching it. But guys, if you guys are enjoying the video, go into that like button. Let me know you're enjoying this video. Okay, we're going to jump in the gleaner. Okay, it's at 52%. Not bad. Listen to her fire up. Did it fire up yet? Oh, there she goes. There she goes. But for some reason, I got my. I must have my sound down a little bit. Okay, um, shoot. Okay, whatever. We'll just take over where the... Yeah, we'll just take over from here. Jump in her. Turn her on. Oh, wait. No, no. They're too wet. No, dude. They're too wet. Shoot. How long do I have to let them dry for? And will we still have time to harvest? Dude, I got one more day. That's it. I got one more day to get the corn and beans out of the ground. That's it. This is going to be a time crunch. Oh, dude. We need some type of dryer. Okay, I better save the game in case this doesn't work and this all goes bad. Oh my gosh. Dude, is this going to work even? Man, when are these going to get dry? Okay, boys, we may have to be harvesting at night. We may have to harvest all night. Um, Oh, dude, that's not good. That's not good at all. That is not good. I don't know if we're going to have enough time to get these out. Shoot, dude, they only give us three days to get this out. That was kind of my fault, actually. I set seasons to three days. I wonder if I could switch it. I don't think I can switch it back to like six days now that we already started it. Okay, I don't even know why I just parked the combine there. Dude, there's, oh shoot, we got to run the clock. Okay, I cannot leave this clock running though because this is, our, I think this is our last day to harvest. This is literally our last day to harvest. Don't tell me they, they're going to screw us over like this. Okay, can we try it now? Oh no, dude. Oh no. No, this is not good. This is not good. It's ton, a ton of our crop is still in the field. No, dude. Okay, I'm going to check back at 13. We'll check back at 13. Dude, come on. Come on, please. We're going to lose so much money from our crop just sitting in the field right now. Holy crap. Please, please, please. And then we got a field. We got a cornfield way back there. Yeah. And then, oh, bean field too. Can I harvest? I don't think I can harvest the bean field right now either. Shoot. This is not good. Okay, I'm jumping in trying again. I think I think we're gonna have to sit this one out for a while though. Oh, oh, we're good, we're good, we're good. Oh my gosh, dude! Holy crap! Okay, oh my gosh! Shut her off. We were so lucky there. Hopefully it doesn't rain again. We're good, we're good. Oh, dude, that was that was scary. Not gonna lie, we would have lost a ton of money. We would have lost a ton of money. We would have missed it out on more of a ton of money i mean seed and stuff does cost a lot but i guess land rent and stuff oh boy no we're missing we're missing shoot oh dude we missed a, kind of a lot along here and what i need to do is i need to get that john deere going over there too that's what we need to do okay now now get this there we go knocking her down okay or maybe you know what i might hire a worker out on this one is what we'll do i'm gleaner or no i should hire it on the john deere because the john deere is okay yeah we're gonna do it on the john deere quick i'm gonna uh, please tap to it please tap to it please tap to it there we go sweet okay yeah i'll just hire out a worker straight out here um i'm gonna knock out this little stuff we're gonna fold that pipe in quick and i'm gonna get these little stuff we just missed right here quick there we go get going the john deere's really slow at getting going forward and backwards I noticed we got five liters out of those four for those four uh, plants four stocks oh wait oh dude there's some down there too do we miss oh shoot there's still a lot to do down there oh that's right there's still a lot to get done down there okay I'm gonna get going here now I want to get okay we're going way too fast I want to get a worker hired out here I want to get a worker hired out go Please don't miss anything. Please don't screw up. There you go. You're off. You're off. Sweet. Okay. That's going good. Now, I'm going to jump on the gleaner, and we're going to jump on the other side, and then maybe we'll have to jump down there, too. We might have to do that, too. And then, oh, dude, I, I want to get that skid letter delivered. I really want... That's one thing I really want to do. You know what? We're going to set up the T4, because a lot... Some of this grain, we, we're going to have to... I'm not going to sell it. We're getting in... Oh, no, no, no. Little blue. Little blue. Little blue. Little blue. Little blue. Why was I calling it the T4? 
Blue, blue. Okay. We're going to need the big auger, dude. I, I love this track. This is sweet. Now, one thing is, a lot of you guys were probably wondering, squad, why isn't there a loader on this thing? I don't think it'll work with a loader. I don't think you can get a work loader on this thing. One thing I could do is I could take the loader off the 4755 and just see if it'll even come close to attaching. I don't know if it will. Okay, we're going to back up. And this thing has 65 horse, which should be enough to run the auger. I, it's a big auger, but if we run her full power, I think, I think, I think it'll run her. And then I was also questioning why it has a buddy seat, but the T4, uh, somebody commented in there like, yeah, T4s actually have a buddy seat. I was just surprised because it's like such a small tractor. Okay, we're pulling around the big old farm king. Hey, better turn that beacon on, on. Okay, corn, where does, what bin did I put corn in? I think it was the front one. Man, I hope it was the front one because we're putting her in there. I know that bin's wheat. And you can store like as like wheat, corn, and beans in one bin. I didn't know that, and so yeah, it's kind of, it's a little screwed up. But we're gonna unfold this bad boy now. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna back it up over here. We're gonna pull through here, and I'm gonna swing all the way around here, and that's how I'm gonna back it up this time. I better raise this up a little bit. There we go. Don't hit the truck though. Come on, T4. We're dying now with Bow. Or no, Lil Blue. Oh, dude, that's going to take me a while to get used to. Lil Blue. Oh, dude. That's going to take me a little bit to get used to. This is sweet. I like this tractor. Okay. We're going to back up here. And that way we can at least get through here with equipment. I can't get in my driveway, but that's fine. Dude, I, I feel like I need a new truck. Do we get a new truck? Nah, we don't have the money. We definitely don't have the money. Okay. Are we over it? It's tough to. It's always tough to tell. Okay. Um, Keep. I think we gotta be over it now, don't we? Oh yeah, oh yeah, look at that, look at that, that's perfect. That's perfect, brother. Okay, there we go, we'll lower this. This is gonna work out good. And we'll put little Blue just right here, and just let her rest. Okay, we gotta put that down. I don't know how I put that down though. Is it to the side? There we go, oh, I got her. Oh, a little too far. Right there, sweet, we got her. She's all set up good. Leave a little blue run and the wolves. We can come over here and start unloading in the bin. That'll work good. Okay. Oh, the worker over here is probably going. She's probably going hey, I'm over here. Okay. Oh, this is actually getting done quick. Okay. It's at 45%. You know what? I should, I'll just pull, I'll just let her go. We'll just let her go. Shoot. I, okay. I'm going to tab into the gleaner. Okay, or I'm not going to tab into it. I'm just going to enter it like this. Where are we even parked at? Okay. We're parked over here. But what I'm going to do is. I'll load in here quick, and then I'm going to run the 4760, or the 47, 4760, yeah, oh boy, oh boy. We're going to run the 4760 just right along the combine there and unload it on the go. That way you can just keep on going. Okay, shoot. No, we're going to fill this thing up. Okay, let it, we'll let it stay in there for a little bit. I wonder, dude, can I load back in the, I don't think I can. Oh, shoot. This thing's turning around, so we're going to, oh, you know what? I think I can stop it right here. I think, it, I think I can get it to stop. We'll see if we can. Okay, stop, stop. I think it'll stop at, oh, oh, I threw it off. <laughs> I think it'll stop at the end of the row is what it should do. I'm pretty sure the hired worker will stop. There we go, okay. We're gonna let this thing fill and then it'll make the turn around. Hopefully it makes it turn around. Is it going? Dude, we're in this, there we go, now it's going. I was like, we're in this like insanely weird spot where it was like, I'm not sure if I'm supposed to go or not. There we go, you can see the girl inside of there, look. You can see her inside of there, wait. There we go, what should we name her? I don't know. man, what, what should we name her? Or I guess I should I should probably know my employee names, I guess. Now that I think of it. We're at 93%. There we go, and we'll, we'll just go unload the rest of it into those gravity wagons. And we'll probably fill up the gravity wagons, to be honest. There we go. Sweet. We'll let the combine just take off and go. 4760. She's having a tough time pulling her, dude. Oh my gosh. And you know what? I need to get the gleaner over here to these gravity wagons. But you know what? We're going to fill up the gravity wagons. Yeah, we're easily going to fill these things up. Dude, I need, one thing I need is bigger gravity wagons, or I just need a semi. I guess I have a semi. I just need a grain trailer is what I need. So what we'll, what we'll do is top off. Okay, this is just going to fill it so quick. I'm going to bring in the gleaner over here, though. There's one thing I'm going to do. Dude, I don't know why I tab around all the time. It, I got to figure this out better. I got to figure out some better way. There we go. That, that way it was kind of better. Dude, I love how fast the gleaner goes, too. Okay, we'll throw out the auger on the gleaner. And we'll unload into the back one, probably. Yeah, we're gonna we're just going to fill this up all the way, though. 
Okay, screw it. What am I gonna load into? Or wait, you know what? I can go around here. I can back up and I can go, I can just back up alongside the other side. That way we can unload at the same time. Oh, dude, I thought for sure I was gonna hit that gravity wagon. Okay, I'm pretty sure this might almost fill the gravity wagon. These things don't hold that much. Okay, we'll, we'll get in the 4760 and back up the rest over here too. Oh, okay, no. It, okay, it held a lot. Okay, sweet, that's good. Okay, I gotta get closer. We gotta get closer. This I like this Parker gravity wagon though. It seems to work good. There we go. Okay, that's filling it up. Sweet. There we go. There we go, baby. Okay, now I gotta jump in the gleaner. And we're gonna take off. Oh boy. No, ditch, ditch. Okay, we're getting out of the ditch. Sweet. Okay. It looks like the John Deere's almost done over there. Sweet. That's good. That's good. And then I wanna throw the beaner bean head on. Go to field five is what I'd like to do. Is it done? It's done! Sweet! Okay, it's just gonna sit there. And then we're gonna go... Right over here. Just start... Oh, wait. How much is this? Shoot, this is a lot of corn. This is a lot of corn, dude. Okay, well... What I'm gonna do... Is... I'm gonna let this... I think we're gonna let that be. And I, I just can't forget to come back and get it. For now. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just put the combines on the edge of the field. We're gonna put all the equipment on the edge of the field, and then I'm gonna go sell that skid loader. That's what we're gonna do. And then I'm I'm hoping I I'll probably get bread on here to help me out a little bit. Or you know what? When I'm harvesting that, I'll probably start streaming it. I bet I'll start streaming it. I want to start streaming when I'm like doing these harvests and stuff. I'd, I'd love to start streaming that. That way I can answer some questions too. But for now, we're just gonna put all the equipment. Oh, wrong button. I was trying to put the pipe away. Not hit the not hit the horn. <clears throat> there we go okay we're gonna drop that there and then i'm gonna tab over to the john deere which i always have a tough time tabbing around to there we go 34 percent, and i'm gonna i'm just gonna dump the rest of this into uh into that grain cart over there quick and i'm sure the grain there was no way the grain cart was able to empty out into that gravity wagon i doubt it may i guess maybe it was able to throw the pipe out should be good and then what we're gonna do is just park the combine right next to the gleaner just park all the equipment there, so we'll be ready for next time. But you know what? Dude, I think I have till midnight to get all these crops out. So, I can't fast forward anything. I gotta remember not to fast forward anything. We don't have long at all. How do I unfold this pipe? I thought it was... Oh. Nope. Oh, there we go. Okay. Oh, I was on the... He okay, I was on the header. Oh, it was able to unload everything. Sweet. You know what? It'll probably start... Oh, we got to get over a little. Oh, we hit the 4760. <laughs> there we go. Sweet. It'll pro it might start. No, okay, that's full. Sweet. Okay, we're going to unload over there. And then these gravity wagons, they are 100% full, it looks like. Oh, yeah. Straight truck's able to pull her, though. Sweet. There we go. Okay, we're going to go dump all this. Look at this. A full straight truck. How did I like it? There we go. Oh, you know what? I wonder if the pigs need fed. That's one thing we gotta do. We haven't done chores in a while. Oh, they're a little dirty. They're a little dirty. Okay, we need wheat, barley, and they need cleaned. Pretty much for now. Sweet. Okay, we're gonna do that too. Man, there's kind of a lot to do around the farm. It's cool. Just and Pigs are one thing you just gotta like update every day almost. So you just gotta clean them. Oh, I wonder what those flashers are. I can't get... See those... Are those beacons? I don't know. Okay, we're going to turn our flashers off. I was trying to get these flashers to work. See these little things right here? I couldn't get them to work. Okay, hopefully this works. Oh, no, I'm on the wrong side. But the gra the straight truck should be able to unload. That's one thing that's weird. There we go. Okay, the straight truck's able to unload. Okay, now I got to let... Okay, sweet, it's working. You can hear it going. Oh, yeah. There we go, sweet. But I'm going to have to swing these gravity wagons around and unload this. I'm wondering how much grain we're putting in there, though. I guess you can check. You should be able to check. We have... Oh, you know what? It doesn't say. That's right. It never says. Because these aren't technically in-game bins. But if I were to pull up next to it and like hit refill, I think, I, I think there would be a way to check. Okay, so we're going to pull through here quick. And then I'm going to flip this around. It looks like I'm going to have to drive all the way around the farm quick. Okay. Swing wild, brothers. There we go. We're flying through here. Because the unloading point is on the left. Okay. 
Here's where we unload. Okay, I gotta get the I gotta load up that skid loader yet too. There we go. Sweet. Um, let's start unloading this stuff. Dude, is uh, the little blues run? Okay, little blue wasn't even started up. There we go. We gotta at least have little blue run. There we go. It's sweet. Look back here. You can see all the corn going in. I like it. There we go. You can barely even hear little blue though. Um, okay, that should have been unloaded. We'll pull up quick. Dump the rest. There we go. Sweet. There we go. Look at it. You can see all the corn going in there. Okay, we had that lined up. Perfect. There we go. I wonder how much... I think that holds 250,000 liters, which I don't think we'll ever get there. But there we go, baby. She's working good. Sweet. And we got 32 grand in our parking. Okay, watch. We're going to get another 50. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to leave the truck just right here. What well, I'll do for now. Okay, it's shut off. I got to shut off. Little blue for the night quick we're probably gonna leave her outside actually um okay comments we gotta get oh wait shoot i think our trailer's still over here wait no our trailer got reset shoot yeah our trailer got reset okay i gotta go pick up that trailer quick that's what we gotta do okay so i picked up the trailer dude it took me forever it was like stuck in the ground or something once it got muddy and sunk into the ground Okay, can we make this turn without putting the trailer in the ditch? I always seem to put trailers in the ditch. Oh, hey, she's going in. It's the dead. There we go. I think the skid loader's over here, right? Oh, you know what? One thing we got to do. We got to do chores. We got to do chores, baby. Um, One thing. Okay, so we're going to take over here. I found out where you can clean up the pigs. It's not inside. Um, I think I can get around here driving back. Actually, we'll just drive forward. And this is why we have the 4755 just parked here. It's basically just to clean up. You know what? And I need to put it in just the shed that way you know she doesn't get rained on too much but what you gotta do is you just gotta clean up this corn here i think it's clean all you gotta do come in here scoop this bad boy up oh wait i wasn't low enough i couldn't see it's tough to see from this angle there we go got that scooped up now oh boy um okay we just got a little more right here not bad we're gonna kind of hit the door oh yeah we're really gonna hit the door oh There we go. Sweet. Oh boy. Oh, what did we just hit there? Okay, we're like stuck in the door right now. There we go. I'll just drive around here. And unfortunately, I, I, I can't seem to dump it back in the pigs. Like, I can't go over here to. It won't dump over here. So, what I gotta do is I'm just gonna. I just put it in the storage here. And eventually, I just get it later. So, if I go up here, should be able to dump it. Pull in here. Start dumping her. That usually works good. Okay. We're going to put the tractor. You know what? I got to put it in storage this, this time. I'm not just going to put it outside. We're going to put it in storage. And, dude, this is... We're always going to keep this as a loader tractor. Maybe we'll get another one. But we're always going to keep this 4755. I love this tractor. Okay, let's not hit the beans. Let's not run over our beans, especially when they're so close to harvest. We got, Maybe we'll have to load out manure too, too soon. Okay. Sweet. There she goes. I should probably put the water trailer under there too. But what we're going to do is we're going to get in the skid loader. I'm just going to drop this bale off here because for some reason, we can't seem to get any bales in here. We You can't get bales, straw bales. bales. You still can't get straw. It's just got to be the actual like straw stuff. And you can just dump the straw in there. So maybe I could shred up the bales is what some people are saying. But we're selling her. We're selling the skid loader. You know what? I probably got to unfold. Yeah, we got to unfold the ramps over here. Okay, jump out quick. Jump in the Cummins. Unfold the ramps. There we go. Dude, do you guys like these long videos too? If you're still watching, let me know if you guys still like these if you guys like these long videos. I like dude, I'll make them I'll make them a day long if you guys really want. Okay. We're gonna get in here and load her up. Now usually you want back skillers in, but for now we're just going. We're just going straight up. Just put the weight over the axles there. Right there. Shut her off. Okay. Jump in the comments. We're in and Is it locked? Oh no, you know what? I probably should knock her down, shouldn't I? There we go. Okay, we got her locked down. So we're going over to my friend Jimmy's over here. And it's kind of a ways, actually, is what we got to do. But you know what? The Cummins, she, she goes fast and she pulls R. So there we go. So what I'm going to do is we're going to go up to our other buddy's house. Wait, is that Skiddler moving? Okay, no, Skiddler's not moving. We're going to go up here to our other buddy's house. And we're going to take a right up, up, up almost by his house up here. And then we're going to hit the farm way at the end almost. It's like... Dude, it's a ways away. It's a ways, a ways away. But look at the sunset. Unfortunately, skid loader, she's leaving the farm. But hey, we're selling her for the going price of $55,000. So we're technically going to have $87,000 when it's done, which is nice. 
Okay, stop sign. No cops. We're good. We're good. There we go. But seriously, guys, make sure if you ever if you ever drive, stop at stop signs. Stop at stop signs and save lives. Okay, there we go. We're flying through here. There's this farm. It's just way down there. Why not see how fast we can get the Calvins going? Why not? Especially when we're pulling the skidler in a heavy trailer. <laughs> it's probably the perfect time. Dude, look at the plane. Look at the countryside. Look at this. It just looks amazing through here. Look at it, dude. Would you just look at it? There we go. Okay. Here's Jimmy's place. Now, I think I got to pull in. I, it's been a while since I've been to his place. I think I got to take a left here, and then I can pull in his driveway over here. We're just going to drop it off for him. He's already... He's going to pay me lighter, he said, so... Okay, stop sign. Any cops, guys? Any cops? Any cops? No cop, no stop, baby. Okay. There we go. And we're going to pull in here. Take a left. Don't take out his mailbox. Okay. Dude, what shed should we put it in? Should we put it in the barn? No. Nah. Okay, I'm, I'm going to let him decide what he wants to do with it. I'm just going to put it, like, right in front of his house. He knows it's here. And then he'll send me it later. Okay. Jumping Skiddler, the 333D. This is actually the exact... I've told you guys this, but this is exactly the exact same Skiddler I used at work. Okay. We're going to... And what I did is I worked at a, a, a mining company where we mined uh, basically sand used for construction buildings and stuff. You know, for basements and stuff is what we did. Um, okay, there we go. Skid loader's there. Now, I'm just going to drive back. But, guys, this is going to be the end of the video. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, go ahead and smash that like button. Thanks for watching, guys.